According to this, you're on a suspended sentence. So maybe you should cooperate, eh? Especially as we have a potential witness. Look, I know you want to protect your mum, and I understand that, but sitting there saying nothing isn't doing you any favours. Look, you've broke your bail conditions before. If I charge you, you're straight off to remand, so why don't you cooperate? Are you fancy having tea in the nick tonight? Just had a phone call from Mr. Barton. Apparently, he doesn't know who his attacker was, but he can say for definite it wasn't you. Free to go then. Don't well, waste any more of our time, eh? Hey. Had fun with your wife last night, did you? Before you go off on one, I couldn't get out of it. Could have text. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. It's that Pratt Donny is playing games. Man, what's that got to do with me? He reckons he's been attacked. He's lying, obviously. Again, what's that got to do with me? But I just thought you might be interested. Yeah, well, I'm not. I feel like I never really knew him. Just think of it as a lucky escape. Guy's a total Pratt. Thank God, love, I've been worried sick. All right, come on, what happened? Well, apparently, James phoned the station. Said it wasn't me. Again? Yeah, he told him that he didn't know who attacked him, but swore it weren't me. Oi, do not get sucked back in. You're well shot. What'd you take me for? What with... I'll have that donut and all. I deserve a treat. Tough day. Tough week, but I'm sure you've heard. Oh, talking of which, don't mind me if I skedaddle. See ya. Is he out on bail then? Or have they decided to lock him up? He's home, thanks for asking. But I thought you'd have known that, seeing as you're still standing. Yeah, and when's his court appearance? Oh, let me think, what did he say? Oh yeah, I remember. Released without charge. <laughs> yeah, and all thanks to James, because apparently, he doesn't know who attacked him, but he swore blind it wasn't Aaron. Guess what else I know? That sleeping with you was the biggest mistake he's ever made. So next time you throw yourself at him, remember that. You don't understand our relationship. What is there to understand? That you're a sad act that he can't get rid of? Do yourself a favour, love. Throw in the towel. Well, he's a changed boy since you arrived. I'm glad you're here. Oh, he's a good lad anyway, but thank you. Well, thank you for agreeing to take him to school on Monday. Hmm? No problem. Give me a chance to see if those lads are around. How are you after this morning? Chrissy's worried that you'll decide to leave. Not an option. So you're sticking around? My face will heal, Lawrence. My boy needs me. Good man, good man. Oh, is this a private party or can anybody join in? No, no, we're just talking about what happened this morning. Right. You managed to get a look at them? Not really. All happened so quick. A little bit late when it happened to you, you know. How many were there? Three? Four? Hard to see. Bit of a blur. <laughs> but that Geordie one. He packed a right punch, didn't he? Mm, yeah, him. Proper vicious. Well, they sound like the lads that attacked you. Yep. Certainly sounds like it. 